Yeah, all right, thanks, thanks Dakota. Dakota. We're to welcome our first guest in uh, for this hour. Matt Bennett, the superintendent of Union City Area School District is joining us now. And of course he has uh, his little sidekick with him as well. <laughs> We're gonna be talking about a great benefit, but I do want to acknowledge that Lucy's come back for a visit. I don't think we've seen her for almost a year. Correct, yeah, Lucy's happy to be back though. <laughs> and this is kind of the support animal, the support dog for the school. How's that been going? It's been going well. Uh, she actually visited two classrooms today. So she was in sixth grade. We read a couple stories. She got to visit with the kids, so it's going well. Thank That's you. That's terrific. She is so sweet. She really has grown. She's growing nicely. You say she's starting to settle down a little bit. She is. She is. Yeah. She has to be a year, which she just turned to take the final test. And yeah. now I understand why, because she was a handful up to that point. Yeah. So she's, she's almost completely in. certified to be a service support one, animal. One more test. Yeah. Yep. That's terrific. Great. Good for her. And yeah. the kids still loving her? They do. Yeah. Oh, sweet. We're glad you brought her in. But you're here today to talk about an event that's coming up. Matt's from Mar, and Marlene Kuzma is uh, was a long time. She is a long time uh, teacher at the elementary school, but she's been battling with cancer. Yep. Um, so talk about uh, this event that's coming up because she's from Waterford, and it combines both Waterford and Union City communities, which is wonderful. Yep, it's a it's a unique opportunity for us to allow all the people that really care about Mar and her family to show their support, not mm -hmm. just monetarily, but just show how much mm -hmm. everybody does love Mar. And yes, the, the family uh, resides in the Fort LaBeouf School District, but Mar has been part of our elementary family at Union City Area School District for 25 years. Wow. Uh, they're also a huge wrestling family. Anybody mm -hmm. that knows the Kuzmas knows <laughs> that. So we're bringing all three communities together in one night to show our support for the family. And that's coming up on Monday, right? Monday, Monday night, January yes. 8th. So what can folks expect? Well, the elementary kids are going to be over at the elementary school starting at 5, and they'll have some concessions there and some other things for the community. But then at the high school, we have the middle school starting at 4.30, JV at 6, and then the varsity at 7. And I know I'm going to forget, um, but there is a ton going on. We have <laughs> meals um, that is just, you know, you come through, you don't have to cook that night, and it's just by donation. We're not oh, charging right. anything, just whatever you want to donate. Uh, very generous folks have donated four frame Jack Palou paintings, mm -hmm. so those are going to be uh, auctioned off as well as basket raffles. Mm -hmm. um, not to mention Mar bracelets mm -hmm. and a ton of other things going on. And that you get evening. to watch some area wrestling. Yeah. Yes. Now, will the, like the raffle baskets and the food is that all in one building, or do you have those those in both buildings? It's all going to be in the high school okay. building. Yep. Okay, so you had the elementary kids doing their thing in the elementary gym, but all of the other events are taking place in the high school gym and lobby and Correct. cafeteria. And, and for the folks that want to transition over, once the elementary kids are done, that'll work out nicely. And mm -hmm. if they want to come grab a bite to eat, see the older kids wrestle, um, et cetera, might be, might be a fun evening for them. Yeah. How did you think of this event? How did it come together? Well, it was all three communities, like mm -hmm. I said. Um, LaBeouf has been fantastic through the planning stages. Um, they really want to support the family as well. And like I said, anybody in wrestling knows the Kuzmas. Yeah. And uh, they as well. But the Union City, uh, in particular our elementary school, have really been missing Mar um, yeah. over the past year. And uh, th this really is just as important for the people that are attending and giving because um, it makes them feel better that they're supporting Mar in some manner. Yeah. Well, so many times when you know somebody who's going through cancer, you just say, what can you do? You, you want just to don't do know what something. to do. Yeah. And when there's such an organized effort like this, it's easy to, to get involved and do something. And that opportunity is coming up on Monday. Yeah, so there's the rundown again. At 4.30 it starts, Miller's, middle school's in the high school gym, five o'clock the elementary schoolers in the elementary. Then six, you got JV boys and high school girls in the high school gym and varsity boys in the high school gym as well. So a whole big evening filled with food, <laughs> wrestling, fun, good folks, and raffles and all that good stuff. And it's all for Mar. Yeah, it's all, all for, Mar. for Mar. Yeah, that's and perfect. We lost Lucy. We, yeah, we she's over there. Lucy. She's over there playing with Ariana. She's sniffing around. <laughs> yeah, well, We've got all doors closed. She won't go anywhere. She's, she's in our kitchen now because we had great food in here yesterday. So yeah. Well, Matt, thanks so much for being here and sharing a little bit about Lucy and about that event again coming up on Monday. And you don't have to cook, I think it is. Absolutely. It is a yeah. great Thank you for the coverage well. of yeah. the event. We really appreciate sure, it. Sure, and go support Mar and come back when Lucy gets all of her certifications. Will do. Yeah, with lots of pictures from her roaming around the schools. We mm -hmm. love that.